used to put tennis balls in your tires when you a kid. Loved it. Or little uh, bicycle cards on the side and go, Brrr. or soda cans on the back of the deal. Good morning. You know, so you have this like a little motorbike. Anyways, it's beautiful fallout. Autumn's here. Show bam. Let's get to the Monday product review. We got a headlamp. Okay, so this thing, it's a Viz. Link down below, of course. It's a Viz. Some sort of, good morning, Croc review going on. Good morning. Headphones in, tuning out reality. So it looks really cool. The thing costs like 50 bucks or whatever. It's got a bunch of lights in there. Let's see. I mean, there's some red lights. There's some offer. Good morning. There's red lights. There's the main light. And then it has like this other mode. Okay, so this thing is bad, all right? I do not recommend this product. I can't stress it enough, it's so frustrating. There's so many things about it. First off, there's too many modes, all right? They need to take a lesson from Apple and simplify. All right, it's bright, it's good and all. It takes like three AAA batteries in the back. Good morning. Um, but for the price and the complexity, good morning. It's just no good. It's a little heavy. It flops down. But the thing is, is that I don't want to read the owner's manual. I don't want to remember all the settings. Sometimes, good morning, sir. Sometimes, you're on YouTube. Sometimes the thing blinks up here, okay? And it just drains the battery. And, and there's like certain modes, hold hold three times and press. It's like Morse code, you know? I don't want to do that. So overall, hands down, I did get it off Moose Jaw. Good morning, fellas, thanks for commuting. I did get it off moosejaw.com, link down below. That site's awesome. That's the same.